Good morning. Big day is here. Big day meaning today is the uh, movie premiere. I'm probably going to be the only pe person going in flip flops and uh, toothpaste in the backpack. <laughs> You know, for some reason, my Uber driver looks a little familiar. Ladies and gentlemen, Lucas! Hola. Hello, thank you for the ride. We're gonna go get a uh, sandwich over at the Vintage Grocers. It's a Malibu hotspot. I'm not gonna look like I'm paparazzi there with my camera, so I'll see you guys in a sec. Through the magic of uh, storytelling, we're here. We're at the movie premiere. We also have uh, one of Lucas's relatives. Do you want to say hello? Hello. Hey. <laughs> That's Vicky. Uh, we're walking over to a premiere um, over in Beverly Hills. Let's go check out the action. Let's meet Ari, the guy who made the film. We're with Ari Davis, the creator. What, what title do we want to give you? Director, creator, uh, visionary? Director on this one. I'm excited <laughs> for Jax to be here. Uh, he's got his cameo, of course, and we'll see him on the big screen. Looking yeah. forward to it. Uh, by the way, Ari's one of my longtime friends from San Diego. Asked me to be in the film. I was super honored to. Honored to. It is going to be amazing. I've already seen some clips of it. I can't show you guys because that would be copyright. Unless yeah. he gives me a thumbs up. No, 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 no thumbs up on that. It's a uh, free festival screening, so we can't um, can't release anything yet. Yeah, there you go. But go go to the website, go check it out, check out the social media, and look for any of the movie. Yeah, yeah. There we go. So we got some uh, some goodies. What is your favorite snacks? Because mine is Sour Patch Kids. These guys got Starbucks, oh, raisin oh, oh, That's a false order. Nachos. And water, of course. Okay, just like that, we're back. Um, today's gonna be a, a short video. I can just sense it. Uh, wow, seeing myself on the big screen. I was a little bit nervous before uh, seeing myself. <laughs> but I'm actually pretty proud of the job that I did. And I really like the story that is told in this movie. Um, it's kind of like a, a, like an empowering story for women um, and super relevant right now because of the whole, you know, Harvey Weinstein thing going on in like LA and, and all the stuff like surfacing up and people coming forward and especially like the entertainment industry, the music industry, you know, all the stuff is going on and this film is actually really relatable for current events even though it was filmed like four years ago um and also it's edm i know there's a ton of people who are into that kind of stuff so i'm hoping it turns into a cult classic and uh and people you know find it and you know take something you know great away from um you know the the meaning of the story and to um you know you just have to watch it it's cool and i have no idea where it's going um as far as like the festival circuit, but it's gonna go out there someplace. Hopefully it comes to like some kind of digital thing in the future, I don't know. Those are, I just showed up and said some lines. <laughs> That's beyond my knowledge or expertise. Anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, tomorrow I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, so, but I might go for a bike ride or something. And then I'll be out of here like in a couple days. I'm hoping to meet up with uh, Sawyer Hartman. Um, this weekend, which would be in a couple days. So, that being said, uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode.